Hello everyone! This year, I cosplayed as Asuna from the anime Sword Art Online. The accessories on her boots looked pretty simple, so I decided to make my own and share this DIY project with you. I also did a tutorial on Asuna's hairstyle, and I'll link that video on the screen and in the description box if you'd like to watch it afterward. Before we get started on this DIY project, I want to show you one of the boots that I've already done. This was my first time working with craft foam, and I'm happy with how it turned out. Here are the materials that you're going to need. First, you'll want some white boots, preferably without shoelaces. I couldn't find any, so I settled for these cute ones that I got on eBay. Next, you're going to need one sheet of 3mm craft foam. You're also going to need a piece of paper, pencil, scissors, Mod Podge, silver acrylic paint, sticky velcro, hot glue gun, and some type of heat source. Start by drawing Asuna's boot armor on a piece of paper. You should look at a reference picture for the step. Once you're done, draw in the back strap and make sure to shade in everything that's supposed to be silver. When you have your drawings, cut them out and arrange them on the boots. This will help you envision what the end results will look like. If you're happy with this draft, you're going to trace it on the white craft foam. Make sure that you do this very lightly, especially if you're using a pencil, so you don't drag it on the foam sheet. When you have one armor piece, trace the other one because we're going to need two of them in order to make the outline pop. You can then cut the cross from the paper and trace that on too. Lastly, trace the armor strap on the foam sheet. Now cut everything out and there should be 4 pieces in total. Hot glue the armor outline on top of the armor and I'd recommend doing this one part at a time. When that's done, position the cross in the middle and hot glue that down as well. And you should have something like this. In order to shape the armor so it hugs the boots, you're going to need some type of heat source. You can use your stovetop, oven, microwave, or heat gun. I actually find that's easiest to use a candle, so I'm going to light it up. Put the foam armor a few inches on top of your heat source, and in about 45 seconds, it will get warm and wilt. At that point, shape the armor around the boots and hold it there until it cools. If your boots have shoelaces, I'd recommend you to take them off first. When the armor is cooled down, it should hold the shape. Continue the previous steps with the back strap. At this point, you need to seal your foam with Mod Podge before you can paint them. Edit three thin coats and let them dry for 15 minutes between each time. Then I'm painting the armor with some metallic silver acrylic paint. I did three coats of paint and I also let each coat dry for 15 minutes in between. When your boot armor is all done, you're going to attach it to your boots. You can either hot glue it on or make a slip on. If you don't want to ruin your boots, then you should go with the second option. What you're going to do is wrap the boot armor and strap around your boots and hot glue one end of the strap to the boot armor. On the other end, you're going to match them up and use velcro sticky pads. And you're done! You have yourself some Sword Art Online boots that you can wear when you cosplay as Asuna. On average, a pair that you can buy online will cost around $50, but this DIY pair is only around $25, and you still have lots of material left over for other projects. So here's a look at the boots with my complete costume. The outfit and sword was from Light in the Box, and the links will be listed in the info box. I wore these boots to an anime convention recently, and they lasted really well throughout the day. They're easy to slip on and take off, and best of all, they were simple to do. I hope this tutorial was helpful, and don't forget to check out the Asuna hairstyle video. If you have any questions or additional video requests, feel free to comment them down below. Thank you for watching, and I shall see you soon! Toodles!